there's been some great moments this past year, but you know, just like uh, you, Chuck, at uh, at Murr's prom, man, you never forget your first. So I gotta, I gotta go. <laughs> I can not hold it. I can not hold it. In. So <laughs> just, just like you at Murr's prom, you didn't get your first. I gotta go with Troy Aikman, man, because that was literally the first interview that we did right there at Memorial Stadium interviewed him live on the air for Tiger Nation. And uh, since we're approaching the anniversary, man, we, we Roy has that queued up. Let's go to the first ever interview on the pregame show during the pregame with Bishop and Neely sitting down with Troy. Super Bowl champion Troy Aikman here with us. Uh, thank you for joining us. You got I really appreciate it. Uh, Troy, you came in uh, to, to catch this game today. Talk a little bit about uh, what, what it means to uh, catch your uh, old teammate. Yeah, I, uh, I I was so proud of Dion when he decided to take this job on. And I just think it validates all that he's done over the years with the kids and, and the high school level that he's coached and to kind of put himself out here at Jackson State uh, was really impressive to me. And I've told him that. Um, and I think he's going to do a great job. And so when I found out the games, I didn't realize that they were playing in the spring. I thought the games, you know, were canceled or they had, this team had played in the fall. And so... To, to, to be able to be here today for his first game, uh, I, I just was not going to miss it. it. It was important to me to be here, and uh, to, not just for support, but just to uh, make sure he knew that that what I have told him in the past and, and how much I think this means uh, that it means that much to me and, and to support him and, and be here was, was everything. Sure thing. You know, a lot of us feel like we know Coach Bryant. Because, yeah. because of his career, social media, but you know him. Yeah. What can the Tiger fans expect out of your friend, Deion Sanders, our coach, Brian? Well, I think he's a tireless worker. I, the, this is really important to him, um, a, a, as it should be. And so they're going to get uh, everything he has. And uh, I'm excited about the program. Just there, there's, there's, you know, we were, I was talking about it with some, some other friends of ours, teammates and stuff. And, you know, here's a guy who hasn't played in a long time. You know, uh, I haven't played in a long time, but of, of those players, he still has gained his relevance with the current players. I mean, it's they don't just know him as a broadcaster or someone who's on television. They know Dion as a player. Mm -hmm. And there's not many players uh, that have been out of the game as long as we have that current players feel that towards. And so he he's he's been able to remain connected with the younger generation. And I think it gives him a leg up on on in in some of the areas of recruiting. Uh, I think he brings a uh, credibility to this this town uh, that that a lot of people just wouldn't simply be able to bring. And uh, I'm excited for him. You know, I really am. I, I think he's going to do a great job. And and of course, it all kicks off here this afternoon. You guys had a big hug out there. Was it? A, yeah. Was it a surprise? Did he know you were coming? He did not. No. I wanted, <laughs> wanted, to, wanted to surprise him. And yeah, it uh, was was special. Well, yeah. we won't hold you up. Thank you for stopping by Tiger Talk before the end, folks. I mean, you look great. You look like yeah. you still threw, throw a few passes. Uh, well, a few. <laughs> I could throw a few. I just couldn't take a few hits. So that's that's, that's yeah. the problem. Sure we appreciate your time, Thank man. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. You bet. Appreciate you. Bye.